So uh, you can just see the guys down in Lourdes here, the Polish especially, managed to get that bow down and get the boat going, and that'll pay dividends for them early. We've got a, the Russians there. Oh, looks That's like they've uh, dipped <laughs> the so wing and uh, the might have been infringed. Who knows? We don't know really what went on there, but that's certainly not fast. And I think it looks like what they're trying to do is roll tack them. So they, we've seen another team just do exactly the same in uh, in the mid fleet. There, they come through and the forward hand grabs hold of the stays and really cranks it over. But if you get it wrong, which might have been what happened there, they, uh, they end up slipping off the boat, which is not ideal. We uh, have our tracker back, so that's a good thing. We can uh, get a gauge on who's who in the zoo there, Troy. Yeah, well, we can see the Brazilians obviously in the in the in the lead, but uh, they're going to be closely followed, and it's going to be tight between the British, um, the the Kiwi team as well. Alexander, Alexander Maloney. Maloney just going to come around probably in third position, I'd say. The Germans just going behind them. Yep, so that's into third. Good set there or by the leader. Close one actually between the the Germans and the Kiwis. So Kiwis might just roll them here, that carry that speed through. So you can see the the Italians there just had a couple more manoeuvres. Uh, here come the Kiwis into third. Yeah, they're going to come around the same mark. It's going to be tight between the Germans here and the Kiwis, but the Kiwis are probably going to be just on the outside here. So they want to try and get that tucked away and then get the bow up inside the Germans so they get clear out of this mark. Looks like the Japanese and the boats coming back in from the right have made a game back. So we've got the Japanese and the Italians crossing ahead here of the, of the Kiwis. And there is our leaders up and around the top mark. Wow. Another good set there, boat length and a half, and that thing was cracked, which you would expect in these light airs. We've got the Polish coming back in here for the right-hand side. They might just nab third here. Um, the Italians are gonna, are gonna come around here in second spot. Yeah, an absolute masterclass by these girls here. Very impressed of um, how they're going, and they're just you know, coming past the bottom marks right now. They haven't got far to go to the finish, and here we are, crossing nice the job. finish line. Nice job there by Brazil, number four. Both these boats are going to lay in. It's going to be pretty tight, but I'd say the Polish are going to get there yeah, pretty yeah. comfortably, actually. They've they got, got a nice little puff there. Double stringing, so yeah. uh, nice work there by the Polish ladies to come across in second spot. Third will be the Italians. Italians. Nice. Looks like the Kiwis are just going to sneak through here ahead of the Japanese, so that was a position change. So the girls, the Kiwi girls will be happy with that. little change, and that will give them one and more point.